Our kidneys are essential filters, keeping our bodies balanced and healthy. But when they fail, it disrupts our well-being. Dialysis steps in as a lifeline, replicating the kidneys' functions. Through this procedure, those facing kidney failure find hope for a better quality of life. But did you know how this procedure works? Let's delve into the intricate workings of dialysis. Dialysis is not just a crucial intervention. It's a meticulously designed procedure that steps in when the natural filtration capabilities of the kidneys decline. By mimicking the kidneys' intricate filtration process, dialysis maintains the balance of electrolytes and fluid levels within the body. This preventive measure is vital as it prevents the accumulation of toxins that could otherwise pose severe health risks. In the realm of dialysis, there are two primary methods, hemodialysis and peritoneal dialysis. Hemodialysis involves circulating blood outside the body through a dialysis machine, where it's filtered to remove waste products and excess fluids. Peritoneal dialysis, on the other hand, utilizes the body's peritoneal membrane in the abdomen as a natural filter. In hemodialysis, Blood is withdrawn from the body through a vascular access point, such as an arteriovenous fistula or catheter. The blood then flows through a specialized filter in the dialysis machine called a dialyzer. Inside the dialyzer, waste products and excess fluids are removed from the blood, while essential substances are retained. The purified blood is then returned to the body restoring balance and alleviating the kidney burden. Hemodialysis sessions typically last several hours and are performed multiple times per week under the supervision of trained medical professionals. Second method is peritoneal dialysis. Peritoneal dialysis utilizes the peritoneal membrane, a natural lining in the abdomen, as a filter. A catheter is surgically implanted into the abdominal cavity, allowing for the infusion and drainage of dialysate fluid. A sterile dialysis solution is infused into the abdomen through the catheter, where it remains for a prescribed dwell time. During the dwell time, waste products and excess fluids from the bloodstream pass into the dialysate solution through the peritoneal membrane. After the dwell time, the used dialysate solution is drained out of the abdomen, taking the waste products and excess fluids with it. Peritoneal dialysis can be performed at home, providing greater flexibility for patients. These two types of dialysis offer different approaches to managing kidney failure, allowing patients and their healthcare providers to choose the method that best suits their lifestyle and medical needs. Did you enjoy this fascinating exploration? If so, show some love by hitting the like button, sharing it with your friends, and subscribing to our channel. We appreciate your support and thanks for watching.